He is a mass hole, ladies and gentlemen. He is a mass hole. Picking on Chop Shop VIP fan Corey Landcore. I'm I'm sure he's gonna get a not favorable write up in the Landcore report after this show. <laughs> Nothing less than seven stars, ladies and gentlemen. But you want to talk about stars. These are two very undersung stars of the New England region right here. Both Mike McCarthy and Bobby Ocean are household names in my not-so-humble opinion. And they're here to do the dirt at Watch This Fight Pink. This is something that I believe the rest of the roster should be watching intently. Oh, without a doubt. What they could learn from these two, I, I mean, one of... One of Mike McCarthy's first matches back from a hiatus was against AJP, and AJ learned so much from him. I mean, he got an ass whooping of a lifetime, but he learned a great deal from Mike McCarthy. I remember going back to, uh, I believe it was Legacy 7, Mike McCarthy mm -hmm. wrestled Frank the Crank, and, and Frank was still very young in his career, and he too spoke a lot of what he could learn and what he did learn from Mike McCarthy. Well, I don't want to shift the attention too far away from our competitors in the ring, but to piggyback what you just said, T. Phoenix, we've watched the notorious AJP's you know, meteoric climb to, to where he is now, and I would say it started around the same time that he was proven against a guy like Mike McCarthy. It certainly opened a lot of people's eyes. You know, it's one thing to wrestle here at the Chop Shop, but, you know, gaining that exposure in other places certainly helped, and doing so against somebody the caliber of a Mike McCarthy was uh, definitely a big help as well. Now let's bring our attention back to the gentleman in the ring. We've talked about McCarthy. Bobby Ocean is another one who, in my opinion, he tends to be heavily undersung and looked over. You're talking, they're looking at, he may be a former, but last I remember he was the TOS heavyweight champion, the test of strength promotion based out of Hartford, Connecticut, run by Slick Wagner Brown. Bobby Ocean brings it to that sixth gear every time he is in the ring. A lot of people overlook him because of his, you know, his lack of size, but I guarantee you, you want someone who commits 150%, you want Bobby Ocean. Absolutely, 13-year veteran, trained by Jason Knight, former ECW roster member. And look at him, he's got, he's got quite the body, you know, People say, oh, he's not very big. I mean, that's compared to, like, the land of the Giants, that being uh, New York and WWE. But he's got some size to him. He's put together, like, uh, you know, a body I wish I had, we'll say. <laughs> I agree with you there, my friend. You know, the conditioning of Bobby Ocean is unparalleled. He's never put a cigarette near his lips. He's never put anything unhealthy in his body. Is he married? Um... I can't answer that. Because that could be the kiss of death more than the other two. <laughs> well, I mean, he's wrestling, so he won't be married for much longer. This is true. Catapult sends McCarthy face first into that top buckle. McCarthy said he was going to be choked the F out, but apparently Bobby Ocean had other ideas. Ocean with those hellacious lariats. A very old school type of wrestler. He wastes very little motion. I'm not mad about it. Neither am I. Makes everything count. And that goes back to what you were saying. The guys in the back should be watching this. Less is more. You don't have to kill yourself and go 150 miles an hour to get the job done in there. Less is more. It can be effective. Make it count, and you get yourself a victory. Well, you know what, too, T? It's like, yeah, you want to be able to exert energy, but you want to do so at the right times. And Bobby Ocean has done that. He, he's gotten McCarthy up off the offensive. He's currently in somewhat of a defensive shell as we speak. But McCarthy's very quick to recover. You can't give him a whole lot of breathing room. He'll take advantage of it. Ah, 617 coming up. Dial it up. Nope. Oh, he crank called him is what he did. He, he palm striked him. Should have had a V8. McCarthy's got some plans for Ocean. Took a little bit too long. Oh, and both men take the ride to the canvas. Gave him the old nature boy slam. There's nothing natural about that. That was a hellacious fall.
Neither men yet to respond to the standing four count issued by our official here. You talk about experience. New England Hall of Famer in the ring calling them, calling them action. I think TJ's got the coolest referee get up out of anyone else in the area. Oh, no doubt, no I doubt. really do. Puts his own little twist on it. Ocean not wasting any motion. Ha. It's the ocean of the motion, or the motion of the ocean. Big swing and a miss by Bobby. What a counter by McCarthy. Tilt the world takedown into a. He's fighting it. He is fighting. He does not want to give up that arm and He's end up in the rings for that of Saturn. Cross face. No, I'm sorry. Rings of Saturn. Rings of Boston has been countered. You know what would be cool? He should name it Rings of Foxborough. Ah, I see what you did there. Yeah. What? What? What's that from the peanut gallery? Big, uh, you know what? I don't even think we should comment on that. No, we're going to let that one fall flat, T. Meanwhile, Bobby Ocean did have a cross face, a crippler cross face applied. McCarthy working back up to a vertical base. But Ocean's right there to chop him down. He knows his adversary. This may not be the first time they've locked horns. Certainly the first time it's taken place here. Oh, I thought that was it, Rossi. Right back to it. And this time he's got him hooked, and oh my goodness. Those rings of Boston are cinched in deeply. Bobby Ocean doesn't appear to be giving up. Official TJ Richter surveying all of the events taking place. But what Ocean, wow, never mind. I thought Bobby Ocean was on the way to reversing that and, and reversing the, the torque on it and rolling up McCarthy. He came dangerously close, but he couldn't hold on long enough. Mike McCarthy comes out with the victory here at Watch This Fight Pink. 